and, and they have uh, advised us uh, relative to, again, privacy, employment laws, uh, the possibility of suits down the line. Uh, you, you know, the, uh, there are enough lawyers in our community that they, they know those dangers. I, I also know you should always listen to lawyers. Because well. it's not, you know, if, if, if there was a strong, you know, if they, they were, if adults were cheating on the children's behalf in the school that we all, first of all, rely on a lot and also fund, I don't understand the protection for them necessarily. And maybe, maybe you'll tell me that when the, the board uh, uh, report is put out in May, it will be a different situation. But I'm not necessarily sure if, if it was serious malfeasance, what level they should have protections. Uh, if it's a criminal case, if it's a disciplinary case, it seems like the parents have a right to know exactly what happened. And, and, and um, in all due, with all due respect, um, the decision uh, to accept the recommendation was my recommendation to the board, again, based on um, direct information from the individuals. Uh, uh, there's always a judgment call when you're dealing with these issues, but we're uh, dealing with a individual, a couple of individuals who are highly respected in this community, and um, what I uh, would offer to you as some secondary or tertiary evidence is that uh, I uh, would we would I pull um, would I take the action I've taken for no good reason for a spray off on an exam? But what action have you taken? I'm sorry. What is the action you've taken? It's a resignation. Well, there's going to be there's going to be a disciplinary action on uh, one individual, and we have a resignation from another individual. So I think that's those are two things that are happening that impact this community. Okay. Would I want to help? Would I would I want to assist that impact unless there was good reason? Okay. Thank you.